Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Capricorn Goddess. I hope you guys are doing well. This is going to be a collective message for all. Um, take it as it resonates. If it does not resonate to you, be on the lookout for my future readings or even some of the readings that I already have um, on my page. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and tap in and see what's going on at this time, collective. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What messages do you have for the collective? Messages for the collective at this time. <clears throat> Woo! We have abundance. Okay, collective. Look! Ah, bottom of the deck, protection. This is beautiful. You guys are protected at this time because you are loved. The divine loves you. And they want to give you this abundance. Or you are already abundant. And it doesn't have to always be financial. It can be when it comes to love, you are abundant. When it comes to protection, spiritual protection. From spirit, from source, you are protected. You are abundant. Let's see what this abundance card says. <clears throat> I'm just curious to know. Let's see. This is beautiful energy, by the way, collected. It says, everything is blooming in life. Open yourself to receive abundance, fulfillment, and prosperity are ready to be activated in your life. Life desires you to prosper. You are moving toward an uppouring of money, energy, time, or love. Didn't I just say that? It says opportunities are limitless. However, you must take action in the direction of your dreams. Don't wait for abundance to fall into your lap. Take steps. Give deeply and fully. Don't hold back. This card reveals that this is a great time to make investments. The more you give... With the free and open heart, the more you will receive. Be grateful for what you already have and even more will flow to you. So I feel like, okay, this is beautiful. Spirit is asking for you guys to be grateful. Um, have gratitude for what you already have. Some of you guys are really, really abundant already. And Spirit wants to bless you with even more abundance as you continue to be grateful and have gratitude. Um, some of you guys are huge givers. I'm picking that up. You are protected in no matter what you do. I love this energy. <laughs> I love the energy. This is beautiful. Know that you are loved. Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? This is beautiful. Messages for the collective. Alright. Messages for the collective. Holy Spirit, Holy Angel. Some of you guys could be seeing 222 a lot, uh, 444 as well. Ooh, that's a lot. Messages for the collective, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Messages for the collective. All right, we have the Princess Wands, the Hermit, and we have the Eight of Swords show you guys some of you guys could be dealing with a fire sign leo aries sag or some of you guys could be a fire sign you could be dealing with the virgo as well i feel like somebody here tried to keep you stuck from i'm hearing your passions your creativity yeah, someone knew that you were very intuitive, 
collective, very wise, very ancient energy I'm picking up from the hermit. Somebody knew you were very passionate about whatever it is that you do. And they didn't like the fact that you love to do it. This is, whatever this is you that brought you joy. Yeah, this could have been a lover. We got the lovers here. You could be dealing with the Gemini. This could have been a jealous lover I'm picking up. Yeah, Seven of Swords. They didn't want you to see that they were jealous. They wanted to betray you because of... I'm picking up whoever you are. You were putting your passions before this person at some point during the relationship. This person wanted you to abandon, I'm here, your dreams. <clears throat> What is this? Seven of this? Yeah. Um, some of you guys could have felt like you were investing in this person and they were not giving you anything back in return. And my apologies, guys. I got the kids here, so bear with me. You might hear some playing and things like that. Uh, my apologies in advance. Um, but yeah, I feel like you were investing in this relationship. And it was going, I'm here going to shit, going to crap. It wasn't going anywhere. It wasn't growing. So you turned that pain into passion. I'm here. Pain into power, pain into passion. Yeah, Princess of Swords. People are watching you do this. I was picking up that energy. I just did not say it. I'd rather it just come out. But yeah, there's a lot of people watching you do what you do. I'm here, scholar. I just heard scholar. So some of you guys could be teaching something or what is this? Yeah, king of this. There could be a king of pentacles type of energy here watching you. Um a uh, Taurus Virgo Capricorn is what I'm getting. Or this is your sign. This is still a beautiful spread, but I just feel like somebody was sneaky here. Very deceptive energy. This was a fox. This was someone you were partnered up with in a relationship. And I feel like this person didn't want to see you be the best. They didn't want to see you win. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles. In the Prince of Swords, this could be someone you had a family with. This is somebody that could be very, very impulsive as well. They wanted things their way or the highway is what I'm here. Yeah. Queen of Wands, this is you. This is how they view you. Very sexy, very abundant, very confident. I'm hearing Jack of all trades. Look how many arms she had. You can do it all, whoever you are. Fire, energy, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Yeah, there was a king of swords here. An air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Somebody wanted you to take a leap of faith with them. But they were slow to move. They were slow to move. Whoever you are, you are very passionate about what you do, or you're just a passionate person. A lot of fire energy, yeah, two of cups. This could have been someone you were in a relationship with here. Yeah, look, he coming back out, King of Swords. He came right back out. This is an air sign. Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius. Yeah, this person can have water in their chart. Cancer energy here. Yeah, this person is in their emotions about you. I feel like, yeah, this could be a Leo. We have the strength card here. Or you could be a strength card. Somebody is strong here. Somebody's resilient. Somebody here perseveres through whatever it is they go through. Yeah, the Wheel of Fortune. Very abundant. Somebody feels like 
they're getting their karma at this time, whether it's good karma or bad karma. Yeah, Ten of Cups. Somebody sees you as happy on your own Nine of Cups and by yourself, your own wish fulfillment, Four of Wands, you're happy. You're celebrating by yourself, and this is the truth. Ace of Swords. You don't mind being alone. Spirit take care of you, whoever you are. You do have protection, abundance, and love. You are loved by the universe. You're not worrying about anybody else loving you because you know your worth, whoever you are, collective. You are loved. You are so loved by the universe. Whoever you are, very, very loved by the universe. Look, somebody wants you to know, Collective, they're not sleeping well. They are not sleeping well. This could have been someone that snaked you in the past or currently. Somebody's not sleeping well because you are protected by the universe. What else? Overwhelmed. Yeah, somebody. Look, didn't I say that word passion? You are passionate about whatever it is you do. That's what I'm getting here. Yeah, somebody is overwhelmed by how passionate you are about something. I'm getting creativity. Your creativity, just the uniqueness about you collective. Somebody. It overwhelms this person about how confident you are. And they try to do everything to tear you down. They betray you. They lied to you. They wanted to keep you stuck and in your head. Some of these people could have, you know, gave you sex to keep you stuck. Drugs for some of you guys. It could be anything. Money. Whatever. It could be gifts. Because we did have, then we have the, yeah, the Six of Pentacles here. Um, yeah, I feel like somebody's struggling without you, collective, or this is you. Yeah, it's a divine masculine. Yeah, energy doesn't lie. Some people can see this person's energy changing. People at work, people around them, they see that this masculine it's heard about some is what I'm getting here. Yeah. You will be a CEO one day. So whoever you are collected, you are destined for greatness and abundance. You will be a CEO one day. Okay, collective. Sexual healing is good for me. So yeah, I said sex. Some of you guys, you give great sex to this person. You heal them through sex. We always pick that energy up. Some of you guys have a healing yoni. Feminine energy. And if you are a masculine, you have a healing stick. You know? What is this? Yeah, I'll be loving you forever. <laughs> so whoever this person is that tried to betray you and snake you and lie to you, they want you to know they'll be loving you forever, no matter what. They see you moving forward. Yeah. This person could have uh, had you feeling, you know, had your, your judgment cloudy. Had you confused, you had to refocus your thoughts and get back on your path is what I'm hearing. Yeah, somebody tried to blow you away with their passion, their sex. <sighs> yeah, we had pregnancy. So for some of you collective, you could have got pregnant by this person. Yeah, this was toxic as hell. And slowly losing my mind. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know what this is collective, but somebody, it could have been a pregnancy here. For some of you, you left this person and now you finding out you're pregnant or something like that. I don't know. Take it as it resonates. Somebody could feel like you're a bugaboo collective or you feel like somebody's a bugaboo. Somebody's waiting on you because they can't get over you. Could be dealing with the initials K here. 
Somebody can't get over you. All right, collective. Let's see what else. Some of you guys can have a fake friend around you. Look, abundance again. Some of you guys are going to be extremely abundant. Somebody has bad intentions because they know you're about to receive this abundance in your life. And I feel like somebody, that's the reason somebody want to return to you. Let's see. Spirit, what additional messages do you have for the collective? I don't know. The energy here at the top, this is beautiful. Now, all of this down here, I don't know. I just feel like, yeah, look. This somebody from your past. Six of Cups. Somebody went, look. We got the lovers again with the two of wands. This could be a Gemini or a fire sign. We got the eight of pentacles. Somebody want to work with you. This is somebody you ended it with from your past. This person could have had some sort of secrets about a third party. The moon and the three of cups. Yeah, and you left this person out in, in the cold to get your victory, to get your success that you deserve. Some of you guys could be some sort of influencer or a speaker or something of the sort. Let's see. Yeah, seven of swords, ten of swords, twice. Two different decks. This deck and this one. Look. Seven of swords. Twice. Ten of swords twice. There was some lies and betrayal here. That could have left you in your feelings. Collective ace of cups. This could have hurt you, you know? This person hurt you. But now I feel like... You are... And I'm guided to pull my abundance cards now. Divine abundance. I feel like you are, you have a partnership is what I'm hearing with the divine. You left this person and you focus on spirit. You are in a partnership with spirit I'm hearing. This is so beautiful. Yeah. Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? Non-duality, yeah, you're alone at this time. Individuality. I feel like you're in the energy of finding yourself, finding out who you truly are, collective. Non-duality. Let your authentic humanity shine forth while also bowing to the inner divine you can become fluent at doing both i feel like some of you guys are meditating at this time and really tapping into your higher self focusing on you and your individuality it says every person has their own personalized study plan in this earth school yeah you studying because you are extraordinary there's a wild and impetuous uniqueness to you that deserves to be honored, collective. You are very, very unique. There's nobody like you. You're letting go and loving you. Everything is indeed out of control and God will hold it all. I can safely let go, I'm telling you. Some of you guys have a partnership with spirit here. This is beautiful. Why this person is worried about you. Yeah, sacrifice. Sometimes surrender is painful. God's cutting away all that needs to go. Illusions, obsessions, addictions. It's a sacrifice to love. Spirit had to sacrifice you. And I mean as in... Spirit almost had to put some sort of shield of protection around you. That's why protection is here. Because somebody tried to take you down, collective. Yeah, limitless. See yourself open to receive in the most miraculous ways. The divine can use anything and anyone. Spirit had to cut. I'm hearing couple cut cut a couple of corners for you, collective. I'm hearing just go with the flow. This is beautiful. Spirit has put a very thick shield of protection around you. Yeah, awakening. 
Oh, my Lord, wake me from the life as a spiritual sheep. May I hear you through my own instincts and common sense. This is a very, very spiritual reading today. I feel like you guys are going through some sort of awakening here. You're realizing how extraordinary you are and you're learning how to let things go and become your authentic self. This is beautiful. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to keep pulling. We can pull more on this person or let's see. This is beautiful energy. I don't even want to mess it up. Let's pull some of these. The person you let go, collective. Let's see what this person has to say. <sighs> Let's see. On the other hand, you know, collective, you're doing your thing. It's looking good for you. Let's see what this person has to say. You could be dealing with the Pisces. You could be dealing with the Leo, a Gemini, a Cancer. The earth sign, um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. What is this? I dive in and out of relationships. So the person you're dealing with, collective, they dive in and out of relationships. This person is very confused. Don't know who they want, what they want. And this could have been part of the reason why you left this person as well. It was confusion here. Yeah, I still have some growing to do. This person that you were dealing with, collective, take it as it resonates, but I'm getting this person didn't know who they were, and you knew who you were. Yeah, one-sided relationship. That's why this relationship was one-sided. You were working on you. I feel like when we work on ourselves, it gives us... The, it gives us, I can't even get my words right. When we work on our, ourselves, we can be better for not only ourselves and our family and other people around us, but you can be better for that other person as well. I feel like if the both of you work on yourselves, that's how you guys come together and um, it helps their relationship when both people know who they truly are and there's no insecurities or things in that nature. Dang, why is it so hard for me to get that out? <laughs> It's like my mind went blank. So maybe somebody feel that way. Maybe somebody wants to tell you collective how they feel, but they can't find the right words. Look, I find you incredibly attractive. Mind, body, and soul is what I'm hearing. Look, I feel you. So whoever this person is, they miss you and they feel you. You could be in separation with this person. But I feel like overall, you guys are happy. And I don't feel like you're being selfish. I just feel like you've been through enough with whoever this is. And now, you're putting your passions first. Is what I'm getting here. You are loved. You are protected. Look, spiritual teacher slash healer. Some of you guys are meant to be some sort of teacher here. Didn't I say scholar earlier? I believe I did. It's your time to show up and shine, collective. It is your time. Yes, look, transformation, karma change. Um, You guys are going through a massive transfer, transfer, transformation at this time and it's beautiful yeah we got twin flame energy here so this can 
this spiritual journey is definitely going to lead you towards that your twin flame energy towards something very, very spiritual. This beautiful. And look, it says, if you keep rejecting me, I'm going to snap. So be aware of this person. Look, there go that abundant again. You will be extremely abundant. Queen of Wands energy because of your confidence. Because of you being so passionate. That word passionate. You are so passionate about what you do. And Spirit sees this. Whatever you do, you put your whole heart and soul into it, collective. You're very courageous, whoever you are. But we have this other person here saying, if you keep rejecting me, I'm going to snap. You have somebody wanting to snap at this point. Because you could be just, you know, focused on you. Look, and you know, he's not the one for you. Whoever this person is, Divine Feminine. He's not the one for you. And you know this, so why, you know, waste your time, energy? You will be the first to do it in your family. So whoever you are, Divine Feminine or Masculine, you'll be the first CEO in your family or... I don't know. The first to do something within the family. This is beautiful. You've been working hard and you deserve a break and it's coming. So, yeah, your ancestors are watching over you, collective. They see how hard you're working. You are protected. It's been a long time coming, but change is coming. Hold on. You have nothing to worry about here, collective. There's an air sign in the Five of Cups. I don't know, but this is looking beautiful for the collective. Let me pull you guys one of these before I go. These are the angel answers. So whatever it is that you were worried about collective, we're going to see what comes out. And we may get a response from Spirit at this time. Whatever it is you've been thinking about. Spirit, so what messages do you have for the collective? What answers do you have for us? They want you to let it go. Let go. Whatever it is, let it go. Whether it's worry, stress, you know, relationships, money, bills, whatever it is. Spirit is saying let it go. Because there's something better for you. We have recovery, so some of you guys could be recovering at this time, and it says unlikely. So, whatever it is that you are asking, meditation brings answers. Spirit is saying for you guys to meditate on whatever it is you want to know. Something could be an unlikely here. Let's get one more communication. No, communicate clearly. So, Spirit is asking for you guys to communicate more clearly about what it is you want. We all know you can trust. Trust in the process. We all know whatever it is that we put out into the universe is what we receive back, if you believe that. The universe only responds to whatever it is we tell them. So... Take this message as it resonates, Collective. I hope this helps someone out there. Um, I'm very proud and happy for you guys. You guys have a lot of abundance coming towards you. You are protected in this process and you are loved. Take care, Collective.